Welcome to another video of Tech Lab. Today I am going to show you guys how you can improve the performance of your hard drive and make it as fast as an SSD. And it's going to make your computer very fast even if you use a hard drive as your boot drive. Making read and write speed faster, boot time faster and launching applications and games faster. In short, you are getting all the benefits of an SSD from your hard drive with a little cash. So let's do it. First, I'm going to benchmark the hard drive that we are going to speed up today. It's a Toshiba 2.5 inch 5200 RPM hard drive. As you all can see, the hard drive speed is very low and we got only 90 Mbps reading and 83 Mbps writing speed which is very bad if you want to run Windows 10 or any other latest operating system. Now I am going to download Primo Catch. It has 30 day free trial and there is no sign up required. Go to the link in the description below and download Primo Catch and open up the folder and double click and run the installer. Install the application and restart your computer. After the restart is done, open Primo Catch. Now we are going to create a partition from our SSD. Go to manage and then go to disk management. Then select your unused space of the SSD and create a drive. Let's name it uh, G drive and I'm going to name it as Primo Catch Gaming. Then finish. Our SSD drive is created. Now we are going to benchmark our SSD. The reading speed of the SSD is very good, but the writing speed is very low. So I am going to test it once again to see if there is any difference. From second time, I got the same result. It's 236 Mbps reading and 88 Mbps writing speed. Now it's time to create the cache memory. Select Manage Level to Cache and select the SSD from here which is Primo Cats Gaming. You can see, this is this one. Now select format and it will format the drive. Press OK. And now we can see our level 2 cache is active. Now we are going to assign our cache memory to the hard drive. Select the desired drives and click next. Don't change anything that you don't understand here. Now select preset configurations and select configure accelerate read and write. Remember don't change anything else and click start on windows startup and click start. Now your cache is ready and it's running and it's going to boost up the hard drive. Now I am going to benchmark our hard drive to see whether it sped up our hard drive or not. As you guys can see, the reading speed is 204 and the writing speed is 562. If we decrease the file size and benchmark again, we can see the reading and writing speed increased a lot. It increased to 448 reading and 648 writing speed. Now I'm going to copy a file from a USB 2.0 hard drive to the hard disk. The speed we are getting here is around 30 to 35 MB. But why? Why the speed is very low? Why? As you guys can see, our cache is hitting only 2%. Because the drive we are copying from is not fast enough. That's why we are not using the cache and our copy speed is very slow. Moral of the story is, if you copy a file from a faster storage, the speed would have increased a lot. Let me show you another benchmark, which blew my mind. Now I am benchmarking the hard drive with a smaller file size and as you guys can see, the reading speed is insane as well as the writing speed. What happened here is the level 2 cache is the SSD and the level 1 cache is actually your RAM. 
As you guys can see, I have 2.69 GB of level 1 cache. When I copy a 2GB file to our hard disk, it's actually writing it to the RAM. Then it's going to write from RAM to the hard drive later. But you can use the file at the same time. When we benchmark with a 4GB file size, 2.69GB was written to the RAM and the rest of it was written to the SSD. So the reading and writing speed was adjusted between the RAM and our SSD. I have a very limited RAM in this system, only 8GB. But if you have a lot of RAM in your system, like uh, 32 or 64 GB you can do this trick and make your hard drive very 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 fast so guys don't forget to like if you like this video also consider subscribing and ring the bell icon see you guys in the next one